in the Rider Derby Workshop with TB. WR250R LED headlight upgrade. Righto. Rider DV tech tip. LED headlight upgrade. So the WR comes with a 55 watt H4 globe in the back here. So this nice rubber on it, keeps the water and stuff out. You can buy these on eBay. They're 60 bucks for a set of two. They've got a fan motor in the back of them. They're plug and play. Effectively, once you hook that in there, which way it goes like that, and then plug and play. The problem is, if we take this off here, and remember, never touch the glass with your hand, we can actually put that in there and go about our business. But now we're gonna have dust and stuff in the back of our light. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna undo these two screws, we're gonna put this rubber in over there, then we're gonna put the two screws back on, okay? I'll show you how to do it. Now these, what, these lights draw less than two amps, or around two amps, sorry, where the standard light draws about six amps. So it's better for your system. These are 30 watt. Those ones are 55 watt, but these are 30 watt wide LED, and the difference is amazing. So I'll start doing it. All right, so I've just taken the two screws out of there. A little magnetized screwdriver, just keeping on that. I've got to remember that one goes face down, and remember that the lower point, is it, that's at six o'clock in relation to a globe. Grab our light, rubber. There's no exact science here, just has to go over, okay? It's not easy, but it's easy, if that makes sense. Okay, so now I've got that over there like that. Now I'm just gonna put this back on here. Do the two screws back up. Okay, so I'm just doing this two screws back up. Now we're gonna put this in here. Now you see the fans in the back here when we get it all together. Now you might say, oh, the fan, rain, water, pressure washing the whole lot. Look, I've had one of these on my WR. I'm on the third WR it's been on. It's been pressure washed, it's been rain, it's done bridge to bridges, it's done everything, and it's never missed a beat. So, you know, for 30 bucks or 60 bucks, you and a friend, you and a friend buy a set of those, okay? Have one each, whatevs and they go about them. I also post a link up to the lights shortly. So I'll just put this in here now. Okay, so now I've got to get these clips around here. Look, and they're not without being awkward, I'll be honest. Um, but it's a bit filly, but you'll get there. Um, I've got one in already. Let's get the other one engaged here. I normally just hook it with a screwdriver, push it down, and now it's locked in. Okay, so once that's all locked in and settled, you can see the LED in there like that. Okay, it's all locked in, happy days. Pop this rubber down, seal the back over, and there you go, plug and play.